4 Plus Plus and 5th generation aircraft feature data fusion. The picture presented to the pilot is the fusion of data coming from different sensors through a fusion engine. The key point though for the point of view of this video is that these sensors can be located on other aircraft. The data coming in via data link from the other aircraft is treated like a sensor data stream and it is integrated in the pilot's presentation. One of the implications of this approach, for example, is that the individual pilot cannot work freely with its own sensors. If your sensors are used by others, you can't really play around with, for example, the radar search patterns because you will be hindering the capability of the whole formation. With 4 Plus Plus and 5th generation aircraft, there are systems that prioritize tracks and targets for sensor investigation. The aircraft is usually managing the sensor on its own, without requiring much intervention from the pilot. Pilots are left with some key decisions to take, like to be active, furtive or totally passive, or whether using the full wartime modes or stay on peacetime modes, but there is no playing around with the sensors anymore. This is obviously a big paradigm shift in itself. The pilot has fewer tasks, but more situational awareness, at a level that is not even comparable with the previous generations. Gen 4 aircraft do have data links that give them some level of God's view, but the Gen 4 Plus Plus and to a larger extent the fifth generation are literally built around these features and usually do a much better job from the point of view of the pilot. So the pilot doesn't really need a wingman 